So yeah. you know when we said after the last time we got stuck, we weren't going to do it again. I, I say we. I didn't want to come here. We're stuck. We are. We're about stuck as we were last time. In well, of course, um, last time we were in a hole. This time we're on the sand. First time we're on slippy mud. So, is there anything else? I, I imagine he'll probably want to drive it into the sea next. So uh, when you're in Greece and you need water, just uh, give uh, Park the Night a look up and they'll very often point you in the direction of where the locals get their fresh water. So this water is good for drinking and uh, obviously totally free. So we can fill our two containers up and we can fill the van up. And all of our little bottles as well. Yeah, so uh, that's us good for water now for quite a few days, I think. Yeah, so anyway, perfect way to get your water. Um, we haven't struggled at all in Greece, have we? No, and uh, the sun has done the solar. Yeah, the sun has done the solar. Um, a little drive now that the uh, the Greek garage got everything working for us. So um, Greece has been great. The back box. So far. Oh yeah, back box is fixed. As you can see, uh, we've got it fixed in Greece. Um, that's not moving at all now, so yeah, great, definitely good. Sure We're is. staying on Halkidiki, aren't we? We are, yep, we just need the water bottles out, we can yeah. get those filled. Uh, we've made a decision about how we're getting back. On the ferry? Yeah. We're going to book onto the camping on board ferry from Igumenitsa to Somewhere Ancona. In Italy. Yeah. yeah. You know when we said after the last time we got stuck we weren't going to do it again I, I say we I didn't want to come here um, he's done it again that's going nowhere and there's no four by fours here so that's good isn't it so four blokes pushing me driving, nothing. So they're all standing there at the moment, having a look. But this thing is just getting deeper and deeper into the sand. It would be so different if you listened to me. So I think they're off looking for um, a vi we We're stuck. We are, we're about stuck as we were last time. In, well, of course, um, last time we were in a hole, this time we're on the sand, first time we're on slippy mud. So is there anything else? I, I imagine he'll probably want to drive it into the sea next and uh, we can get stuck in the sea. Oh God. All right. <laughs> I thought you were bringing a nice cold drink. Well, I might do.
So do you think this is the last time we'll do this? Nope. Oh. <laughs> well, that's honest. <laughs> so this is the start of a long job. No, you're not coming out, darlings. It's too hot out here, babies. Right. Okay. Dogs are in here. It is actually nice and cool in here, so we're just going to keep it as cool as we possibly can by shutting all the windows. We're waiting for... Um... Let's turn this round on me. Yeah, we're waiting on... Uh... There's a guy over there who's got a van with a 4x4 with a winch now he's got a 4x4 with a winch but the winch is broken at the moment because he towed someone out who was heavier than him so moral of the story is if you are setting yourself up with 4x4s and winches you're never going to use it for yourself it's always for idiots like us anyway so he's over there fixing it thinks he should have it fixed in an hour uh paul is outside uh digging to australia around the van um yeah i'd say i can't quite believe we've done this again but i can i can this is what we do this is exactly what we do uh we'll be known as uh, that couple who uh, always get stuck in the mud in the sand in holes all the rest of it anyway i'm going to make him a drink um and i'm just going to make sure that i can keep the dogs as cool as possible in here so i'll probably shut the front curtains and just keep it as dark as possible because it is very warm out here um the van is at a hell of a slope you probably can't tell and uh we'll uh, catch up with you and see how this is all going to unfold or whether we actually live here now um which there are definitely worse places to live and uh, according to the guy i've just been chatting to over there uh the weather is really going to turn bad tomorrow so uh we want to be out of here because i don't think well would wet sand be better no, probably not. Yeah, of course, yeah, this is not very good. It's just all the time. Right. Okay, right, right. It happened already, so. Okay. Just wait in the rope so it doesn't spring back and hit the windshield. Okay, yes. Yeah, that would be expensive, wouldn't it? I'm going to stand over here in case it does spring back. Just yeah. Okay. It's gone taut now. And it's now. Pull. Go. Go, 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 go. Yeah. He's pulling. He's pulling. Keep going. Keep going. going right stop stop he's coming out easy on the gas right easy on the gas you're digging down Going backwards. Right, 
Right, he's pulling now. going down. <clears throat> it's still digging on the other side. Yeah. Poodle with its head out the window. Right, he's going again. Right, stop, 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 stop. He's just letting out more cable. It's going, it's going. Right. Stop. Don't do that again. <laughs> I know you said you would. Don't. Well, fortunately, we're both in good humour about it, but look at the mess we've made.